Hello YouTube and welcome back to my channel. I am your girl Beauty Ballinori across all of my social media platforms. If you would, go ahead and thumbs up this video. Go ahead and get a comment started with me in the comment section below. And of course, subscribe and share it amongst your family and friends. But as you already guessed, no more talking. We're here to see the hauls from the Allure Beauty Box and the Scentbird. <sighs> Caveat. This is not April Allure Beauty Box, and this isn't the April scent bird. Both of these just showed up in the mail last week in March. And I know these aren't this month's subscriptions because I just got a tracking email for scent bird sending me out another scent for my actual April subscription. And then, of course, we already know that the April Beauty Box by uh, Allure, spoiler alert, is with Cardi Bible. And I can't wait to receive that one. But let's go ahead and review these additional boxes, extra products. Let's take a look at them. So if you're ready, let's go ahead and get into the video. You're my bitter one taking me home. For one thing really lead to one. Now, the first part is something that we already knew was going to happen and was going to come in anyway. I had told you guys in my last month in March, the actual March since birth, since birth subscription, that one of the ones I received, the top was all jacked up and messed up. So I had reached out to their customer service, and yes, they did go ahead and send me a replacement for it, so I'm very happy about that. But... I'm going to go ahead and tell you guys my thought process with that. So we can do a little bit more in-depth, detailed review of what I actually got. So I had tried to take one of my tops off my old scent birds that I completely ran through. This is Glossier Year U. You guys know this is... <sighs> this is one of my favorite scents so much why I went ahead and bought the big one. But so this is what I actually got from scent bird within those two packages. And I knew that one of them, again, was the actual broken dispenser that I received last month. And then one of them was one of the newer scents they sent me. So this is the one they had sent me, which is the... Wait, where is it? Okay, it's the... Is it Miyake? It's the La Oudou Blue Dice Pohome. Le Odoo Blue DSA Pohomet. Okay, you guys saw me struggle last month with this same scent, and you saw me struggle again this month with the same scent. I thought by putting another one on it, it would actually work and spray, but it doesn't. It drips all down the side, and that smelled like trash. So I was like, oh, Jesus. So they went ahead and sent me a completely empty regular vial. So I'm just supposed to take this top off of this one. And put it on the one that came with the actual defective top to see is this a okay that's better trash trash i can't same thing i said last month i just thought it was just because so much alcohol and oil was leaking and sipping sipping out I, it's this is a man's cologne like straight up straight 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 out of the jungle and woods this is a man's cologne and although i like men's colognes they have to be some type of paired with frankincense or a fruit or it has to be it has to be a mid note or it has to be either a top note or a mid note not the base note but it has to be a mid note or a top note that can sway toward women or unisex in order for me to like it but this is completely a man scent ladies you can't don't don't do this don't don't do this like this it smells like a dude it, it, when i say trash i'm saying trash for me as in i can't wear it and i can't pull it off but now that it's spraying correctly it does smell better than i thought it did last month but it's still it's still a no-go for me because it's too masculine. There's absolutely no way I could pull this off. Even with just one random scent. It'll either smell like I've been hugged and cuddled up with a dude all day. Or it'll smell like I'm a dude. And my husband would. If I can't home smelling like this. Yep. Y'all will see me on Fox 5 News. My, my husband would. 
So it's, I, I can't do that. But this is the other scent that they sent me. I'm not sure it's because, you know, I had a problem with my order for the first time or whatever it may be. But this scent showed up. And this is the Ar Aquastite. R Q Aquasti. 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 Hooked on finest did not work for me. Did not work for me, baby. Anyway, this is the Sydney Rock Pool. And when I say this one, I immediately... <clears throat> okay, it's a little strong at first. So let's, Okay, this is going... Oh, God. <laughs> it's a little strong at first, okay? But once it actually mellows out, you start to get this really sweet woodsy strong but soft but floral but feminine you start to just get this scent that just for springtime it's a bit heavy for springtime but you can still pull it off it's one of those year-round scents that in spring and summer you would spray just one spray whereas in fall and winter you may spray a little a few more sprays two or three but it's so strong and the way it wears on the body um i've already used it i've already been wearing it <laughs> Clearly. <laughs> and you know, Scentbird, because they give you a 30-day supply, I'm going to leave my code information here so you can get a free scent of your actual choice. So you can actually try the subscription before you actually have to purchase it for the actual month. You already know Scentbird is going to bring you $14.95 a month for one fragrance. Now they do skincare and also makeup, so that's something you can look at as well. Depending on the price of the item, it may be an additional $5, and they'll let you know before you select that particular item for that actual month. But most people just do the month-to-month -month service, and it is $14.95 a month. Of course, if you do three, six, nine, or 12 months, then, of course, it becomes cheaper. All subscription boxes are the same. When you want to pay six months ahead of time, nine months ahead of time, a year ahead of time, it's going to be cheaper than the average people like my shelves, <laughs> who still just continue to pay the $14.95 a month. But, of course, if you use my code, you'll go ahead and you'll get your first month for free. So you're able to try whatever scent you want to try. And of course, you know, I'll get a free scent too, but let me show you what I'm talking about. So with Scentbird, you do get 0.27 milliliters as a product. They say it is good for a one-month supply of it. Again, um, I rotate out my scents, so this is one that I would just grab and just drop in my actual purse. Perfect, perfect for you, especially, ooh, Oh, I'm so happy we're talking about this now. You coming up on spring break. You coming up on family vacations. You coming out on, I'm finna get flued out. We finna turn up. You coming out on whatever you've been doing for the last four or five months. You finna show off that progress. Whether you lost one pound, you lost a hundred pounds. You, it is beach season. It's travel season. It's time to catch flights. We're not catching feelings. We're catching flights. It's that time of year. You know what I'm saying? Or, you know, you finna take your kids to the beach whatever or you and you and your dude or your significant other finna go camping whatever but this is something you could just throw in your bag when you're traveling just pick up two or three of your favorite scents throw it in your bag and take it so this way you don't have to worry about the airline if they lose your bag it's a big deal but you're not losing a hundred hundred and fifty two hundred dollar bottle in that bag or if they are throwing your bags around like they often do you're not having to worry about getting to somewhere and it's shattered a hundred, hundred and fifty, two hundred dollar bottle. You have this, and this is a little bit more travel friendly. And you should be able to just drop this right on. I, I always just drop these right on my travel, my carry on with me whenever I'm traveling. So this is a great idea. I'm happy that I was able to review this before you guys started to hit the road. And of course, travel safely, get to your destination safely. Now for this part of the video. This is going to be this month's Allure Beauty Box. Well, I'm, I'm lying. I don't already told you. This is not April. This is something that came in March. I could not keep my little grubby fingers out of this. I could not just pay attention to this. I had to just really just look at this particular one. Um, because when the minute I open up this month's Allure Beauty Box, I'm going to leave you guys a coupon code to where you're able to get five months off your first month. Typically, this will run you $15 a month the first month. You'll be able to get it at $10 a month. And you also get a gift from Allure with your actual beauty box. But with this particular month, 
they had the Glow Recipe Watermelon Jelly Mask. And this is something I just hauled and bought, like, what, two months ago from Sephora? When I tell you I love that mask, they're $8 a piece. So it's not necessarily the cheapest masking, especially if you do a mask every day or you do masks three five times a week. I typically do a mask on my face. I mask every day. One day I'll do a clay mask, the next day I'll do a moisturizing mask, and the day after that I'll do a sheet mask. So I mask every day. But when I tell you this, just left my, my skin so hydrated and so plump. I didn't break out, didn't have any allergic reactions or anything like that to it. Taking it out the pack, it is, it, it's weird when you take it out the pack, but it works. It works. I really love this, and this is what I wore um, two videos back when my makeup went out with that, uh, that hydro grip, that my, my gripping primers battle with the video and how my makeup just sat and applied so smoothly. Obviously the primers had something to do with it, but any base of your makeup routine is always going to start out with your skin. And the best thing you can do for your skin outside of drinking water, taking your multivitamins, working out, staying away from, you know, foods that aren't good for you anyway. Save the child who's about to finish this video and go to the Great American Cookie Company. <laughs> but skincare. The better your skin, the better position you can get your skin in, whether you're dry, combo, oily, doesn't matter. The better your makeup is going to apply. And, of course, once you clean your skin, exfoliate your skin, do a sheet mask, it allows your serums and moisturizers to actually penetrate your skin. So I'm happy with this one. I didn't even have to open the actual book to actually go through this one because, again, I had already bought it and I bought mine from Sephora. But, of course, you can get it from GlowRecipe.com. And pretty much it's their Watermelon Glow Jelly Sheet Mask and pretty much it has watermelon extracts and natto gum so it's like a jello texture that really does cling to the face uh, so it is one of those sheet masks that you can get up in a clean house pretty much when I do sheet masks that stick to my face I'll just start vacuuming cleaning up doing different things like that you know how some sheet masks you put it on and they like just flopping all over the place so you have to Tell my toes, she'd be like, I can't talk to you right now because the sheet mask just be, or if you lean completely set up, it'll start to just melt off your face. I don't have time for those type of sheet masks. But let's go ahead and take a look at the next thing in the actual box. So it did come with a milky, cleary type bag this month. So it looks completely white, but it's kind of milky. It's kind of milky a little bit. So you can see through it. So let's go ahead and take the items out and let's just see what we got. And the first thing that we got is going to be by, wait a minute, huh, this is by All Natural Cosmetics and this is their Anywhere Cream Multi Stick in Grapefruit. So it's pretty much a golden peachy cream blush on your cheeks and of course with stuff like this you can actually use it. Pretty much as lip as a lip a light lip balm a little bit so it retails for $35 and this is a full-size product hmm huh this is interesting so let's go ahead and take a look at this this is the actual product and again everybody gets grapefruit and this is a heavy package this is this is weighty don't smell like grapefruit Let's just see how much product you guys get. For $35, that's pretty good. That's pretty standard. It doesn't say right there. Let's see if it says on the box how many. Oh, it expires. They actually put an expiration date on here. You know how some products will let you know, the little makeup container lets you know how many months the product is good for. You know, from opening, whether it's, you know, three months after opening, six, some go up to the... Um, 36 months after opening this one actually has just an expiration date on it okay that's pretty cool but it doesn't really tell me how much product i get i'm so stupid i'm so sorry guys it's nine milliliters of product which is 0.3 ounces so this is how much product you get now let's go ahead thank god it twists back down because that was gonna be horrible so let's go ahead and swatch it right here and let's just see how it is this is a blush. Of course, you would want to warm it up on your skin a little bit. 
Okay. Spoon that out. Oh, it's a sheeny. Still don't smell like grapefruit. It's, it smell it's, it smell like spearmint actually. But let me show you. That's the actual blush, and that is beautiful on women of color. Um, color, of course, if you are lighter complexed, it's going to be more of a pinky gold sheen shift. But of course, the more melanin you have in your skin, it's gonna go peach. And for women of color, peach is such a really pretty blush, especially if you're not one of the ones who like really strong, hard blushes. Like if this palette just scares the bejesus out of you and you're like, no, then something like this, more of a peachy color would really work for you and really make you happy. Now, doesn't set quite all the way. So it's not one of those cream to powder type. So this is going to be an actual cream blush. Um, I'm not really into this, but for this particular product, I definitely want to try it out. I want to give it a try and see how it is. And the one thing I noticed when I tried to close it right now, <laughs> um, I had it up just a little bit like that. And when I went to go close it, it went close. So I was actually just shoving the top down on the product. <laughs> Don't be an idiot like me. Go ahead and screw your product back down and then actually close it. And it actually snaps closed. So that way it's good and you don't have to worry about it. And even in the package, even when it twists, you know, I decide, you know, I can show you what not to do and what to do by destroying and damaging my own. It actually doesn't twist up the actual product. So even if you're traveling, and it gets in your container and it starts to move around. You don't have to worry about getting to your location and it's all smashed in the top. So this is, I'm here for it. All natural, I am here for that. So, so far we have the glow recipe and the all natural. Thumbs up so far. I can't, hmm. The next product in the box is $23 and it's the Mamande Rose Water Toner. Um, I use the Mamande from our box last month and it gave me Miller. It broke me out. So I can't use my Monday products. Um, after that, it, it could have just been what was in that one product that caused that. But when you have an allergic reaction to certain things, I personally steer clear away from the brand. I did look at the product information, you know, the list and stuff on the back just to try to see what was in it that actually caused me to break out. They say this is pretty much organic rose water. It's 100% organic rose water. And I have a rose water toner that I use that doesn't break me out and doesn't give me Miller. But this is what the product actually looks like. This is the travel size, but the full size retails for $23. And your box, you're gonna get the travel size that is 25 milliliters and 0.84 fluid ounces. Let me show it to you guys. So I can't do anything with this. This is, but the other product that I have will be in upcoming favorites for you, actually, guys. So that way we can talk about that and go over that. But this is pretty good as long as you know organic rose water. You're not allergic to rose or rose water or essential oils or whatever it may be, since that's all a part of rose water. As long as you don't have any allergies to rose or anything like that. Um, I'll let my daughter try it because she used it and she didn't have any problems or issues with her face. Wait a minute. Oh, oh my God. It smells so good. And it smells like real roses with just a tinge of fake rose smell. You know how fake rose smell can be really strong and off-putting and very dated, very pre-1990s dated, like some smelling from the 70s and 80s. This smells so fresh and hydrating, and I could definitely see emptying this into a spritzer bottle. Any of your old spritzer bottles, empty this into it. And what I do with my toners, I actually put them into a spritzer bottle, and I just spray them on my face. So this way I have this spa feel, and I just feel like I'm in a commercial, when really I'm just standing there out the shower spraying stuff on my face in my bathroom but you know to each his own whatever makes you happy right so we'll definitely follow up with this one 
And the next thing we got in our box is going to be coming in from Belief. Okay. So this is their True Cream Aqua Bomb. The full size is $38. We got the travel size. And they have two versions of this. One is the Aqua Gel for oily skin. And one is the Aqua Bomb. Hold on. Do I got that backwards? Yes, this is the one for dry skin. So the Aqua Bomb is the one for dry skin. And they have another one. I think it's a green color. But it's the other one. I'll leave the information right here on the screen whether I'm right or wrong. But I'm pretty sure this is the one for your regular skin. And they have one for oily skin. The one they have for oily skin is amazing. I love it. Um, the one for dry skin didn't do anything for me, surprisingly enough. It didn't do anything for me. So I'll pass this one on to my daughter. But this is the travel size. And in the travel size, you do get 10 milliliters of product, which is 0.33 fluid ounces. And I'll go ahead and pass this on and give this to my daughter since we'll be traveling. So these are great for travel. <laughs> Pretty much everything in this video, guys. These travel sizes, these small sizes... The perfumes, the clones, all of this stuff. This is pretty much your grab-and-go travel bag. And these bags that they give you guys, you're able to go ahead and just slide your products in there and boom, just throw this in your suitcase. Now, because this doesn't actually completely seal all the way, I would definitely go ahead and just pack my stuff in here and slide this in a gallon size Ziploc bag and just zip it closed. So in case something breaks, spills, or opens in the bag, it's not all over your clothes and stuff when you're traveling. But this is a great idea, guys. Next thing is from Occur Seriously, and this is their Soothing Night Oil. And they have 10 blends of hydrating oils in here. And they mix it really lightly to help diffuse the oils. So pretty much they say you would use this after your retinols, your serums, different things like that, your toners, any type of treatments you have. This would be something you would put this on to go ahead and seal in at the end of your beauty routine, whether it's in the morning or evening, whenever you do it. And this is what it looks like. Now, this this one, um, the travel size that we got is 0.3 fluid ounces. It's 10 milliliters of product. The full size for one ounce is only $12.99, and it comes with the pump on it. The travel size that we got, the weirdest thing about it is it comes in a roller ball. <laughs> and I'm not going to lie. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to think this is one of my... Cologne perfumes that I have that are rollerball scent that I'm gonna be like, why does it smell like anything? Wait a minute. It smells like blue agave. It smells It does have a scent to it Certain oils and oil blends have a natural scent to it And it smells really great light fluffy and airy and just really scented why you'll see those blends in a lot of hair care and scare care products if you are sensitive to smells boo This not for you. Don't don't try this because it smells like a light, really, really light perfume. It smells good. Now let's go ahead and see. And it blends right into the skin. You can't even tell where I put it in. Where you can a little bit. A little sheen right there. But it blends right into the skin. No problem. Hmm. Hmm. They say if you have dry skin, you can also go ahead and use this prior to your actual makeup as kind of a primer you know how they have the primer oils that you guys can use prior to your actual makeup so I'm gonna try this out no problem I just need to make sure that I actually leave it in the actual box in my bathroom because I'm retarded I'm gonna think it's like a perfume or something and try to put it on that way so I'll leave it like that okay the next thing we got in our box is gonna be from glam glow super mud this is their super mud clearing treatment and of course, this is a travel size, and it is half a fluid ounce or 15 grams for you guys. This is the white one that helps, helps with uh, clearing and treating your skin. So anytime you're having any breakouts, like, hello. Yeah, I got into the chocolate. Anytime I eat chocolate and everything like that, or if I eat a lot of fried foods, I'm going to break out. But yeah, I couldn't help it. I couldn't help it. I went to the movies to see us, and I got into the goobers. I ate the yeah, yeah, yeah. It's not about me. It's about the product. Anyway, so I'm glad I got this so I can use this to help kind of clear up, you know, my little friend that showed up. <laughs> but the full size is $59. And pretty much this is oil absor absorbing and it also draws out the crudities in your face. And I love Glam Glow's face masks. Glam Glow's face masks are spot treatment masks or all over masks. I use them for spot treatments, literally. 
What I do is I'll wash and exfoliate my face and do everything else. And then there's one area once I'm finished doing everything else, I'll take toner and I'll rub and clean this area completely dry of all the other products. So I've done my complete skincare routine on my actual face, right? I'll take a cotton pad and go around here and completely wipe all that off. And I'll go ahead and put this on a pretty thick layer and go to bed. I use it as a spot treatment and in the morning, if it isn't gone, then it's pretty much flat underneath the skin so it doesn't show up like that underneath makeup so i absolutely love this and the last thing that we actually got in our box is going to be an visible organic <laughs> these are so cute so these are three of the actual small sizes and this is a traceless hair ring and pretty much this is for when you're pulling your hair in a ponytail so you can minimize breakage and damage to your hair. This is just a scrunchy type of hair rings that you can actually put on your hair. You get three of them in here. This is the smaller version. So when you're going to the gym and you're pulling your hair up or if you're cleaning or doing chores or whatever, especially if you're traveling, boo, let me tell you. Uh, this retails for $7.95 and this is actually a full size product because I've seen these before. Um, different variations of it at Sephora and both Oats, of course, Target, Walmart, wherever you are. But when you're actually traveling, this is something you definitely want to go ahead and take with you. You can be on the road, traveling in a car, it gets hot, it gets cold, you want to just pull your hair up. If you're skiing, going to the cabins, going to the mountains, you're going to the beach, wherever you're going, doesn't matter, especially especially at the beach. You can literally just throw these in your beach bag and when you're about to go swimming, you're thinking you're gonna have that wild things coming out the water looking out cute. Really, you come out the water looking like a gremlin. You come out the water looking crazy as... Boo, throw this in your actual bag. You know that reality versus what I think I look like. I think I'm coming out the water like, yes. Giving you Beyonce, really? I look like a wet dog coming out the water. I look like I got the mange. It look, it look, it look like y'all need to call the health department and be like, we got something on the beach. something at the beach. But throw this in your beach bag, your travel bag, and you'll be able to pull your hair up when you're on a plane, if you're driving, especially at the, especially at the beach when your hair is all wet. Especially if you're like me and you have natural textile hair, or if you are, you know more on the Caucasian side of the spectrum. Even if you have completely straight hair, hair that just waves, as it starts to dry, because you have all the salt and chlorine, depending on if you're at the beach or the pool, and your hair is just like, <sighs> in your mind, you think you're getting those beautiful beach waves. In reality, it's crazy, stringy, fluffy, all over the place, looking like a chia pet if you have natural curly hair. It just, while it's still wet, just grab one of these, put it on your hand, and just pull it up and just go ahead and just put it in the ponytail and just go about your business. That's what I would definitely encourage you to do. But that's it for this month's Allure Beauty Box. Okay, so if you've made it to this part of the video, you've had a chance to hear me just rambling and run my mouth. Then we came to look at the products. <laughs> but you've had a chance to look at Scentbird and also Allure for the Beauty Box. And I left both of my discount codes for you guys. I'm not on that PR team. I don't get paid a commission. No one sends me a check. No, boo. I have to pay for this stuff with my own money. But if there's anything I can do to get you something for free or save you some money, if I see it, find it, or use it and it works for me, I'm definitely going to go ahead and pass that on to you guys. Of course, you don't have to use any of my discount recommendations below. You can just go on yourself and just do your own thing whatever works for you it's cool for me just as long as you get a chance to try out some new products without having to break the bank when it comes to skincare makeup and fragrance hopefully you've seen something here that you like from either one of the Scentbird for the fragrances and now that they do skincare and makeup it may be something you may actually want to look into and of course beauty box by allure they send you so many different things that you're able to choose from and really get a good gauge from but as always thank you so much for coming and spending some time with me today i really appreciate you know just your interaction with you guys any questions comments suggestions you have i really do appreciate that and again i don't care if you're watching me in the morning afternoon evening late at night this plan in the background while you packing to get ready to go on the trip. I want to get flued out. I'm just playing. <laughs> Pay me no mind. Thank you, YouTube. And until next time, be safe and have a beautiful spring break.